Many website owners will upload their videos to a platform such as YouTube and then embed their videos directly into their pages. However, you may have reasons to self-host your own videos. In this video, I will show you how to upload videos to WordPress without YouTube with no coding at all. I will also show you just how easy it is to insert these videos into your posts, pages, and even custom landing pages. Everyone here at Seaprod loves having you part of the community, so please subscribe and hit the bell to be notified of future videos. So before we get started, I just want to mention an article by WP Beginner, why you should never upload a video to WordPress. And if you haven't considered these reasons yet, maybe you should take a look at the article. And of course, it's totally possible to upload and self-host your own video. And if you've already made that choice, then great, let's continue on. But I just want to make sure that you're aware of this and maybe give this article a quick read to make sure that it's the right choice for you. I'll leave a link in the description for this article for you. Next, let's come over to our WordPress dashboard. So I am logged into it completely clean version of WordPress that I just installed. And now to upload a video and to self-host it, it's really quite easy. So this is a beginner video. And on the left-hand side in the menu, you'll see media and we have the library. So let's go ahead and click here. And now I have no media items because again, this is a clean version of WordPress. If you have an active website, you might have your pictures and you'll see all of your videos here and maybe other media such as PDF files. Now there's multiple ways that you can upload media. So this is available if you create a new post or pages, you can do so in that section as well. Now I have a video here and I can just drag this off my desktop. And if I hold it over this section, it'll actually ask me to drop the files here to upload them. Or I can also click add new at the top, or it'll go to the same place here in the menu if I click add new. Now the add new section will have this uploader here. So I can do the same thing where I can drag and drop a file and drop it in here, or I can go ahead and select the files directly off of my hard drive and select them that way. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop this video right in here and we can see that that was uploaded. We can see the name of the file and the file extension as well, which this is an MP4 file. Now, something that you may want to take a look at is the maximum upload file size and I'm limited at 300 megabyte. So this might be something that you want to ask your host about that they can increase it for you if it's very small or if you're going to be uploading very large videos. Also, you wanna make sure that your video file is compatible with most browsers. And at the time of this video, MP4 is the most common. If you have another file format, such as a .mov, which is very popular on Apple devices, you can look for an online converter. There's converters now that will convert from one format to another format. So you can just quickly Google MOV to MP4. You can upload that file to them and they will convert it for you. Many of them are free to use. So great, now we have our file uploaded. If we check the library, we can find that video in this section as well. If I click on it, we can see a preview of this video that I can play. Great, so let's close this. Let's go ahead and put this video into a new post. So I'll go to posts and add new. And here we see a little welcome message. I'm just gonna close this. And I'm using the default theme that comes with WordPress. I'll just call this post video post. And down here we wanna use blocks. So we can click the plus sign or we can use a forward slash to bring up this menu of the different blocks that we can embed. I'm gonna go back and use the plus sign and I'm just gonna do a quick search for video. And the one that we want is video, so we'll click this. And here you can actually upload the video directly, but we already did so and we put it in the media library. So I'll go ahead and click on media library. And here again, you can upload again. So there's lots of opportunities to upload the file. Here we'll go to media library and I'm going to select my waterfall mp4 and I'll come over and I'll select this in the bottom right. Great. So now you would add all of your other content. So you could just add more blocks with more content. You can add a caption if you like. So for example, I could add a paragraph of text, images, a gallery. If I hit browse all, I can see all of the blocks here on the left hand side to make this into a full fledged post. So let's go ahead and publish this and let's view the post. And there you go. This is a live video on an actual web page. I come down and click the play button. You can see that that plays and it's embedded into my page and we are self hosting this. Great. Now let's come back to the dashboard and let's just quickly do the same thing. It's the exact same process with pages. So we can create a new page and we'll call this video page. And again, it's exactly the same. So we'll just click the plus sign, search for video, select video, media library, and then select the waterfall or whatever your file is. Select that. Again, we could put other content on this page and then we'll just quickly publish this and view the page. And let's just test that to make sure it plays and it 
it does. Great, so we have a video post and now we have a video page. Great, let's go back to our dashboard. I just wanna show you one other way and I wanna introduce you to Seedprod. And Seedprod is the number one landing page builder for WordPress. So if you're an entrepreneur or you have an online shop or some type of service or business, landing pages are a great way to capture leads and to grow your email list or sales and to promote your different products and services. So I'm just gonna show you quickly how easy Seedprod makes this as well if you wanna self-host your own videos. So on the top right hand side, you can see get seed prod or the big button here. So you can click on that to sign up for an account. There is a seed prod light in the WordPress store. I'm going to be using the pro version for this example. Once you have an account, you can click on login. On the left hand side, I'm going to enter my email address, password, and then click login. After you've logged into the seed prod dashboard, you can click on downloads. Now let's go ahead and download landing page pro here. This will be the pro version of this plugin. And on the bottom left hand side, we need the license key here. So you can copy this. You can click the little icon here to copy that if you like. And then we can close this tab for now. And then we want to go ahead and install the plugin. So on the left hand side, we have plugins and add new. And up top, we want to upload the plugin. We can take this zip file on the bottom right hand side if you're using the same browser as I am and drag that right onto choose file. Or you can click the button choose file to select the zip file from your hard drive. Let's go ahead and install now and activate the plugin. Here you can see the licensee. Let's go ahead and paste that in and verify key. Great, now we have Seedprod installed and I'm using the pro version and it's activated. If you're using the same browser as I am, you can close this tab at the bottom. And on the left-hand side, we wanna go ahead and create a new page. Now Seedprod has different modes. You have coming soon mode, a maintenance mode. You can customize a login page and create custom 404 pages as well. If you come down to the bottom, we wanna create a landing page. So I'm just gonna click on this. And Seedprod comes with over a hundred professionally designed and mobile friendly templates that you can import into your design quickly and easily. So for example, here's a quick thank you page. I'm just going to import this one. I'll just call this video landing and we'll save and start editing the page. Now Seedprod is a drag and drop page editor. So all of the blocks on the left hand side can be dragged into your page on the right hand side. So for example, here we have a free report. So you can click here to download now, but maybe you want to get rid of this and we can just simply add an opt-in form. So this would actually collect the person's email address and their name, and then they could submit and maybe you could email them this PDF or this free report. Plus this enables you to collect their email address for future newsletter opportunities. Let's say we also want to add a video. Well, on the left-hand side here, we have the video block. So we can drop this in here and we can see a seed prod video here by default. But if we click on the block settings, you can see on the left-hand side that these options change. So by default, we use type YouTube. You can actually go ahead and change this to custom. And then it's asking for custom video code. So I'm going to come back to my WordPress dashboard and we already created a post and the pages. Let's just look at the posts and we have our video post. and I'm going to edit this. And here we can see that video that we entered earlier. I'm going to click on this and there's three dots here for the options. I'm just going to click on this and I'm going to select edit as HTML. Now this will give us a little bit of the HTML that's created for the video. Now I know I said we're not going to be doing any coding and we won't be. So I'm just going to simply select all of this and cut it. And we can bring that over into our block for the video code. And we'll paste that right into here. And there you go. You can see the video is imported into our page. We can save this. And if I click the little drop down icon here, we can publish this page and see the live page. And there we go. In minutes, we created a beautiful landing page that you can completely customize with the drag and drop seed prod page builder. Let's just test that the video works. And there we go. It looks great. Now that you know how to upload videos to WordPress without YouTube, check out this video on how to embed a video, which will show you the process of embedding videos hosted on platforms such as YouTube.